Good morning and welcome to the Great Journey Podcast. I'm Caitlin Clary here with Chief Instructor Sensei Marty Callahan. And we are going to be doing a series on our Dojo Creed. It's probably going to be about five different podcasts as we break mm-hmm. down all the different concepts that are taught in this creed and what we teach our students in our school. Um, and the first one being seek perfection of character. Yes. Okay. Uh, but before we do this, Uh-oh. Caitlin, I do have to tell you that there is an arrow that's trying to crawl up your nose there. Oh. Did you see it there? <laughs> yeah, we got to get that out of there. Okay. We're distracting there that you go. <laughs> Darn mouse. Okay. <laughs> All right. So seek perfection of character. Yes. Okay. So um, um, this is our creed that yes. we say at the end of every class or, or we don't always get it done because of how students transfer, but um, it goes seek perfection of character. Right. Um, and um, basically this is the, the premise that the school is, is based on. The, mm-hmm. the motto of the school is that the ultimate aim of the art of karate lies not in victory or defeat, mm-hmm. but in the perfection of the character of the individual. Right. So here we go, seek perfection of character. Yes. And there's some important components to this statement. Number one, it says seek. It doesn't say be perfect. Right. It says seek perfection. Mm-hmm. And uh, perfection is probably something that can never really be attained right so um the uh, the uh goal is to strive yeah to, yeah it's mm-hmm. the seeking of it is something to aim at and to put yourself continuously on that path okay. where you're working towards that yeah you're always working in, in that direction right right and so um you know what is perfection um well, first of all, the, the probably the key word is character. Mm-hmm. So what is character? Mm-hmm. And character really is the essence of who you are as a person. Right. And um, this is uh, some of the character traits that we focus on mm-hmm. are courage, courtesy, integrity, humility, self-control, as well as uh, several other ones as well. But right. those are the five main ones. Yes. And so um, if a person embodies if these characters are embodied within that individual Mm -hmm. then they have a strong character Mm -hmm. and it's that strength of character that's going to carry them through the difficult things that they're going to face in life right and that actually brings me around to um a book that um i heard about i read a synopsis of the Mm -hmm. book called the captain's class okay And um, this book, the author had studied more than 1,200 athletic teams over like a 50 year period of time. And um, uh, to determine, and these were were teams that were at the top of their game. Okay. So uh, professional baseball, football, soccer, all kinds of athletic teams. Mm And what they found was that the most successful teams by far were led by a person of strong character right. who was on the field. Okay. Not somebody in the office, right. but somebody on the field. Yes. So it was the captain, the team's captain. Right. The strength of the team's captain was the mo- single most determining factor as to whether or not that team was going to succeed. Right. And we see it in the world today, you know, some of the greatest teams in the world. Yeah, you talking about that, I can't remember which year, which Mm -hmm. World Series it was. I want to say 2010, Uh the Giants. Yes. Um, Hunter Pence. Yes. Was, he he was a teammate and an awesome teammate and had a great personality, but he was the motivator to them because they started that season horribly. Yeah. And it was a total underdog overcoming and then they and they end up winning the world series yeah but while he may not have been the captain of the team i it was in the news and everything how he was this motivator in the locker room on the field from the bench um and his character shines through in everything that he does that he's he's obviously a very good guy yeah you know unless he's hiding things really really well (laughs) well um the being the captain isn't necessarily a role or a title that is put on you. Right. It's just that particular individual rises Thanks. to the occasion. Mm-hmm. 
and everybody recognizes that. Yeah. And then they go to that person as the motivator. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you could find videos of, of his, uh, his uh, oh, what do you want to call it? Like his encouraging speeches or okay. pump you up kind of things online. Okay. And I mean, okay. it's like the kind of tearjerker yeah. just gets everybody yeah. all riled up. Yeah. And it yeah. was it was pretty awesome yeah. to see. Good, good, good. Yeah. yeah. So that's baseball. Yeah. That's yeah. the cry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it all, you know, the it, mm -hmm. character development of, uh, applies or character is in all of life. Yep. And character is the thing that that we all have, to, um, we all share right. as human beings. Right. Um, one of the quotes that I talk to parents about when they come into the school is Martin Luther King Jr.'s uh, quote that um, his dream mm -hmm. is for his children to be judged not by the color of their skin, yeah. but the content of their character. Yeah. And we get families that come in here who are Asians and uh, Hispanics mm -hmm. and uh, as well as black, mm -hmm. and um, they all share the same thing, yeah. and and so do us as Caucasians. We share the same thing too. Right. What what I tell them is that there are places across the U.S. where they hate Californians. Yeah, uh, yeah. And if you go there and you tell yeah. them you're from California, you better be careful. They There's may a throw lot of places they hate yeah. us right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and. You know, and I don't want to be judged by the fact that I'm from California. Right. I want to be judged by content of my character. Absolutely. And we all want that. Yeah. All right. So, yeah. Well, great. So seek perfection of character. Seek perfection of character. <laughs> all right. Well, I look forward. And what's the next one we get to to talk about? Um, like be a, faithful. Be faithful. Well, that's a real good one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much. And we will see you next time. Bye-bye. Have a great day.